Hey guys, what's up? Dustin here, once again, back with another video here today, and it is dip review number 10. Number 10, number 10, number 10, number 10. Bah! Fireworks. Anyways, yeah, dip review number 10. And ladies and gentlemen, we've done the wide cut. We've done the long cut. Now, it is Grizzly Fine Cut Wintergreen. Yep. Right there. Yep. So, first, we're going to go over 10 design. It's got this nice, looks like kind of army green, the OD green mud jug. Kind of looks like that. Army green on the front of the can. Grizzly raised letters. Fine cut. Premium winter green at the top. Uh, side of the can is the same. Uh, army colored thing. Whatever. So yeah, that's the can. You know, metal lid and plastic. Like all of Grizzly's dips. So, let's Pack a lip. Get it started. Yes, sir. Ru, ru, ru. I don't know. I'm fucking hyper today, you guys. But. Woo! Alright. Here's the cut. Right there. Fine cut, of course. You guys, I'm sorry to say it. I hate fine cut, but I'm doing it just for this video, so. Yeah. Uh, it is very dark black, you know, very moist. It it looks darker than all the other grizzlies. I can say that. It looks darker than natural grizzly. It looks darker than grizzly straight. It looks darker than actual regular grizzly wintergreen. So yeah. The smell, typical long cut wintergreen smell. It doesn't smell like the wide cut. It smells exactly like the long cut wintergreen. So yeah, let's get a digger of this shit in. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna try. Fuck, probably gonna get every fucking wear, but. You gotta be fast with fine cut or snuff. Because that shit don't play around. But yeah, uh, that's not a decent. I mean, it's a little size, but. Pack my can again. Get another decent size pinch in. Hang on, you guys. Sorry, this is taking so long. Fucking fine cut. put on my lip burns like crazy you don't have to wait on the burn on this one it's right when you put in your mouth and it kind it kind of has a similar taste to long cut wintergreen but it's like more of a chill wintergreen like where's the long cut wintergreen Y'all know it's harsh on your lips and stuff. So yeah, this ain't as harsh compared to long cut linen green. I 
hate fine cut. Fuck this shit. But <laughs> back to the pinchability is shit. It's fine cut. Controllability is shit. Gets all in your mouth when you're talking. It hardly stays packed together in your fucking mouth. I hate fine cut. I hate it. Um, tin design is okay. It's nothing special. It's fucking army green. I mean, army. Don't get me wrong. I support the army and stuff. But the color in this can is just ugly as shit. I mean, so, nicotine, yeah. I give, uh, I get a, I get a little bit bigger buzz on this fine cut than long cut wintergreen. So, definitely nicotine is there. The burn's there. The flavor is good. And the flavor is actually really good. It's actually really fresh and moist and stuff like that. It's just hard to control and stuff like that. Um, I would, I would put this as second, if this was, mm, never mind, no, forget that, um, it's actually, it tastes good, um, but yeah, this, I would, uh, would I get it again, no, to be honest, because it's fine cut. I'm not a pro dipper at fine cuts. I've only dipped fine cut twice. And not, I didn't, yeah. Yeah, I had a can of snuff and a can of uh, Stoker's fine cut natural. So, I only dipped it twice. Um, stuff like that. After a while, after you keep on talking, and pack it down with your tongue. Pack it down with your tongue. It does stay packed. A little, little floated everywhere. You know, stuff like that. But, I will not get this can again. I recommend it to snuff dippers. Snuff and fine cut dippers. Do not recommend it to beginner dippers. Hell no. Because you're going to fucking get all in your mouth. It's going to spread everywhere. And you're going to swallow some. And you're going to puke out the shit and everything. It's just going to be a bad experience. And you probably will never want to dip again. So, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. It's just a, it's just a bad, it's a bad idea. Hang on a second. Here you go. I'm sorry, you guys. Here you go. I wish I could cut my fucking videos out. Anyways. Um, what else? It's not, it's not that rough on your lips like long cut wintergreen. Fine, this fine cut is actually soft. It's more softer than long cut. So, yeah. I wouldn't get it again, though, ever. This is just, this one time. So, yeah, um, I recommend it to snuff dippers and fine cut dippers. No beginner dippers, no nothing else. So, yeah. It's actually a good flavor, though. It's really good flavor. I only get wintergreen every once in a while, like every two months or so. So, yeah. Um, spit is nice, black, uh, last ability. 30. So 40 minutes, excuse me, and stuff like that. Um, it's a good dip, but fine cut, I will never do. I give this can a dip overall rating of 7 out of 10. Yeah, flavors there, just the pinchability and the controllability. Mm -mm. I'm not even a pro at fine cut dip, so. 
Alright, updates on the family. Natalie's doing really good. And I'm doing really good. And uh, my fiance's doing really good. So, we're all doing awesome. Um, just got off work at 3.50, so we decided to make a review on this shit cut. I mean, fine cut dip. <laughs> Most of pe most people will agree that fine cut is the worst dip to ever fucking dip. I hate it. I couldn't even like. I'm sorry for the cope snuff people out there, but I couldn't dip snuff cope snuff every day. So yeah. Um. What else? Uh. I get my paycheck this Friday. I get my paycheck this Friday and stuff like that. So, it's going to be awesome. It's going to be great. Check out my other videos, please. I'll leave my social media links down below. Mud Jug website. Check out, you get yourself Mud Jug. Check them out. It'll satisfy you every dipping needs, please. Playing uh, Assassin's Creed Revelations right now. It's a good game. But anyways, I'll see you later, guys. Peace.